Hey guys, week number two in the NASCAR season is in the past. It's time to look into the future, and that's going to be the 2020 Auto Club 400. First off, though, let me introduce myself. I'm David from the Callie and Jordan Squad. I'm the squad in front of the Callie and Jordan Squad. <laughs> and what we're going to do is we're going to continue our um, NASCAR prediction videos um, slash giveaway, because if you end up with the most points by the end of the season... You get a fifty dollar. You, you'll get fifty dollar gift card, or I'll send you fifty dollars. Um, or as also not or also, if you win the playoffs, hopefully we have eighteen people um, that will be in it, um, in it to win it. You'll be in line to win another fifty dollars. If you're the champion at the end of the playoffs, it's going to run just like the NASCAR playoff series. Uh, there will be so many people that's going to be eliminated, and. Every three or four races, I think it is. And then, yeah, we're going to go to the final race. And then, hopefully, you'll be the last person standing. All right. So, this is the 2020 Auto Club 400. And it's the, it's the next upcoming NASCAR Cup Series race, which is held on March 1st at the Auto Club Speedway in Fontana, California. If you're from Fontana, California, tell us down below and we might give you a bonus point. Heck, if you're in the state of California, comment down below, and you will get a bonus point. All right, so this is going to be a 200-lap race. Um, it is a one-and-a-half, no, sorry, it's a two-mile, 3.2-kilometer D-shaped oval racetrack, um, and this is the third race of the 2020 NASCAR Cup season. So like I said before, it is. So last week um, was a mile and a half race. Um, this week is a two mile race, which is in um, California. And I believe next week is, a, is in Phoenix. And I believe that's a two and a half mile um, race course. So this is the three weeks where the it's like the big tracks. Um, so the first stage is going to be 60 laps. The second stage is 60 laps. And the third stage is 80 laps. So the most wins by driver, Jeff Gordon, Jimmy Johnson, Matt Kenseth, and Kyle Busch have won this race three times. So they're in the lead uh, for the most times winning this. Um, the most wins by team is Roush Fenway Racing with seven wins. Most wins by manufacturer, we've got Ford at ten. Um, let's see. So Kyle Busch is the defending champion. The very first winner, so the the inaugural race was in 1997, and the great number 24, Jeff Gordon, won this race. Um, like I said, last year's winner was Kyle Busch. 2018 winner was Martin Truex Jr. 2017 winner was Kyle Larson. 2016 was Jimmy Johnson. 2015 was Brad Kozlowski. 2014 was Kyle Busch. 2013 was Kyle Busch. 2012 was Tony Stewart, 2011 was Kevin Harvick, and 2010 was Jimmy Johnson. All right, so let's go, let's go back a little bit and let's see the top five from last week. Um, so I picked my top five last week was um, Kevin Harvick, Jimmy Johnson, Kyle Busch, Martin Truex Jr., and Ryan Blaney. This was the real top five. We have Joey Logano that won the race. Matt Dividento was second place, and I put Matt Dividento as my um, as my underdog. So that's a that's pretty good, I think, right? He didn't win the race, but he still finished in second place. Uh, Ricky Stenhouse finished in third. Austin Dillon finished in fourth, and Jimmy Johnson uh, finished in fifth. So I had one driver, one point I got in the five. That is not good. All right, so the five drivers I had you guys pick was between Brad Keselowski, Joey Logano, who won the race. Martin Truex Jr., Chase Elliott, and Kevin Harvick. Um, one person picked Joey Logano, so w within the rules, they get two points for picking um, the driver to have to, to be in first place among the five drivers I had you guys pick from. Also, a bonus point for actually winning the race, so they get three points. So go check out Harvick Fan for Life. Um, they also got two points from the last race, so now they're in the lead with five points. So, remember, tell your friends about this contest. Tell tell everybody about this contest. Tell them to uh, be here every Friday 
every Friday, Saturday, Sunday up until race time, and uh, and let's uh, let, let's get some people in here. We we did have many um, submissions, um, so let's let, let's get some people in here and let's you know fifty dollars is nothing to scoff at. That's pretty good, I think. All right, so like I said, Harvick fade for life. You are now in first place with five points. Um, none of the other drivers that I had you guys picked was in the top five because if they were, you would get one point. So unfortunately, no one else gets a point. Um, yeah, so let's pick my top five for this upcoming race in Fontana. Um, I believe he's going to be in my top five. I think Brad Kozlowski is going to be in my top five. Um, who else is going to be in my top five? Brad Kozlowski. Um, I think Kurt Busch is in my top five. Um, I think Kyle Busch will be in my top five because um, he's he's been struggling in the first couple races, not not doing too great. Um, I think Martin Truex Jr. will be here, and I also think a William Byron's going to be here as well. So that so my top my top five is going to be Brad Gazowski, Kurt Busch, Kyle Busch, Martin Truex Jr., and William Byron. Uh, the five drivers I'm going to have you guys pick is going to be between um, Chase Elliott, um, Joey Logano. Uh, I'm going to have you guys pick. Uh, let's see who else should we do here? Uh, Martin Truex Jr. Let's do Kyle Busch, and let's do uh, Kyle Larson. Kyle Larson is, well, he's not much of an up-and-comer now, because he is, he is right at the top right now, So, uh, but he's still a young driver looking to be more consistent, but I think he has the potential to be. Um, yeah, so those are going to be your five drivers. So you guys are going to be picked from Chase Elliott, Joey Logano, Martin Truex Jr., Kyle Bush and Kyle Larson. Um, also, remember get some get people onto this video. Um, have them pick um, their driver. Uh, tell them right down. It's gonna be. Let's have some fun with this. All right. So remember to subscribe to the Cali and Joe Squad. Hit that notification button so you don't miss out on any of our videos. Smash that thumbs up button. Share, share this, share it. Let's get this contest out there. It's gonna be a weekly contest. Uh, there's, what, 36 total races out in the season, so it's going to be a long one. So if you think that you haven't picked the correct one in the last two races, don't quit because there's going to be a ton of races. And uh, until next time, peace out. All right, guys, see you in the next video.